Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing some life-changing products to solve everyday annoyances. If you've ever had issues with your trash bags falling down in your trash can and not staying on the bag as you're throwing trash in it, this is something we had an issue with. I know there are a lot of hacks on the market, but I wanted something that looked aesthetically pleasing. So when I opened my trash can, it don't look a hot mess. I wanted to make sure it's still blended in and you can never tell that it was on there holding the trash bag in. So I found these little trash bag holders. They're super genius and easy to use. You just stick these on your trash can. They come in a variety of colors. So you can definitely feel free to get the color of your trash can. So it like blends right in. And you can stick the bags inside the little holes and it literally holds the bags in place. So that as you're throwing trash away, the bags are not falling down into the trash can. <laughs> I love these and I found these to be super helpful and they're not expensive. I just rather use these versus other things I know you can use on the market. A really cool item that helped solve some issues around the home were smart home plugs. These are awesome because these are individual plugs. You can also get these in search protectors. I have a few of those too and I will link them. But these turn your home into a smart home without having to break the bank pretty much or change out your electrical sockets. How they work is that you can plug items into here and then you can control them from a distance, either through the app with your phone. You can also turn them on and off with your smart home device like your Echo or your Google Home. You can also put things on timers and routines. So if you want it to come on at a certain time, like in the morning or at nighttime, and then go off in the morning, you can put them on timers or routines as well, which is something that I find super helpful because if there's something you always forget to turn on and off, maybe it's your four year light when you come in or your lamp in your family room. If you wanna turn it on at night or you forget to always turn it off, put it on a timer, set it on routine so that it comes on and go off at a certain time every day and you don't have to worry about it anymore. Also great one things that you know you always forget to turn off, if you always haven't plugged in one of these, even if you're not home, you can always turn it off with your phone, which is another great thing too. So like maybe curling eyes or things like that, something you know you always forget to turn off, plug in one of these so you can always remember you can go to your phone and turn it off without having to turn all the way around, go back to your house to see if you turned it off. <laughs> even Christmas lights, y'all. Christmas season is coming up. This is something I use in every Christmas light. And matter of fact, this one is labeled my fireplace because it goes into my fireplace for my lights. I do not manually turn on any light for Christmas. We put them all in smart plugs so that they come on and go off at the same time or whatever time you want. So I think some of them we do different times because you can put them in groups. So the whole group of lights come on at a certain time, which is usually what I do on my first level. I have them all come on at a certain time. Sometimes the outside lights or ones upstairs I have come on at a different time, maybe later. These are just so amazing. So you don't have to go manually turn on each light or each item. Sofa trays are also really helpful to have around your living room, especially if you don't have like a lot of end tables or places to put things or you don't feel like getting up specifically to grab stuff and you want it right by you. I have two that I'm going to share with you and I use and I like the both of them. The first one is this bamboo one. It is adjustable so it can fit a several different size arms. You have your flexible legs here. And these are really strong, by the way. We have really wide sofa arms and they still work amazingly well. You have a large area here for storing things like your snacks, your drinks, your remote. Plus you have a little phone holder here too. So you can stick your phone in here, whether you wanna watch it horizontally or vertically, you can stick them both in there and it does turn. So if you're sitting this way, you can turn it and watch or see your messages or you know, while you're watching TV, you can be scrolling your phone too. So. I cannot tell you guys how many people have come over to our house and just went to using this. So I was like, oh, this is cool. I like this little gadget. <laughs> so it is helpful. The second one that I have too that I'm going to show you a um, video of. This one is also an awesome sofa tray too. It has a drink holder and it's very sturdy. I cannot tell y'all how many times my kids have ran by. My dog has ran by with her tail and hit it, but the water did not knock over. So it does have a really strong sturdy cup holder, which is awesome. Also have placements for snacks, remotes, things of that nature. So you can put that right there and have, have your remote, have your snacks right by you. Plus it has pockets on the side too. And I love the pockets because you can still continue to th stick things in the pockets as well. So both of these are handy. Again, people come over and start using them. They went and bought them some because they found them so helpful and handy too. So great to have and you don't have to worry about getting up anymore. Another item that I have found to be so helpful and handy around the house 
is having built-in toilet seats for kids. So if you guys do have kids or grandkids or nieces and nephews and they're always at your home, one thing that has been so annoying for me is the big handy toilet seat covers for kids. You know, they're big, they're bulky, they take up so much space. And then if an adult has to use the bathroom, you have to pick it up, you have to move it out the way. Oh my God. Yeah, I did go through that with my first child and I quickly realized we needed something different. And so I came across the built-in toilet seats and we love them. Every single bathroom in our house has these toilet seats and it's been a game changer. So if you have kids, if you're potty training, again, you don't have to worry about having all these different attachment pieces or different toilet seats for the kids. You can just grab the built in. You just switch out your toilet seats on it and it comes with both an adult and a kid toilet seat so that if the kids are coming to use the potty, they just pull down the kid's toilet seat and they're comfortable. If an adult is using it, you can just lift that up and use the adults. So, so handy. Highly recommend those. I have purchased different brands. Um, I, I feel the same about both, you know, it's a few differences, but they're pretty much the same. So I will link the both of them and you can check those out. Now, this is another annoyance for me, like squeaky loud chairs when you're dragging them on the floor and moving them. Oh my God, that annoys me so much when they're loud and they're squeaky like this. So if you have that issue and that problem, uh, easy inexpensive fix is to grab leg chair covers now here's the key some chair covers stick out like a sore thumb some of them do not so they come in a variety of sizes a variety of colors a variety of styles so i'm gonna link the ones that i have used and i just got the color of the legs of my chair and you never know they're on there they do not stand out they do not look like a sore thumb they have the fill at the bottom so they're very quiet they're easy to move and do not make noise and they protect your floors as well so that's another great thing to have if you don't have any or if you have that issue i will link the ones that we've used you know find the color of your chair so they they don't stick out and you can even tell they're on there but they do stop that problem another super helpful item that i've come across that's helped me keep from having a headache and able to find things around the home is having chalk labels. So this is a variety pack that I really like because you get a lot of clips. So these are super easy to clip on. You can change out labels as needed and they use chalk markers. So again, they're not permanent. You can change these out and you get quite a bit of them. And then you also get these type of chalk labels too that I like using as well on organizers, on different things around the house. I love chalk labels just in general because again, I can easily erase, for instance, like this is a pantry item, got a chalk label on the bottom. I write my expiration dates on them. You can write what's inside of it. I do that as well. So like with my pancake mix, I don't want my label showing. So I'll put them on the bottom and I can write on it what's in it. And the great thing about chalkboard labels, you can just erase them. If you decide to put something else in the container, it's not permanent. So you can just erase it and write the new item. So I'm a huge fan of chalk labels and I love these little clip-ons for baskets and things around the house as well. And y'all, chalkboard calendars have been game-changing in our household because when everybody wants to know what date is this on, when we're going where, this is something that can be super game changing, especially like for the whole family. Like I do keep my phone calendar and I keep my desk calendar, but when it comes to the kids and the whole family events and things, having a family calendar has just been life changing because my son can look and count down the days to where we're going. Like for instance, with Monster Gym, he was counting down the days, like as we we're going and you can keep track of what's going on. And even like with the hubs and everybody, we all know what's going on. The cool thing about this one in particular, I really like it because it has a bulletin board at the bottom so you can stick things at the bottom. Plus you have a note section here too. So if you need to do something or someone needs to do something, you can put it right there too. And of course with using child markers, you can make this really fancy, really pretty, really colorful, however you would like. I also find it to be therapeutic just filling it out too. So this is something that has definitely decreased my headaches and everybody can know what's going on for that month. Now, I know this may have differing opinions, but having a water filter that you can drink from in the home has been helpful for us 
especially cutting down on like water bottles and buying book water. This is something that we can reuse and it filters the water. This holds 10 cups of water and you only have to change the filter on this every six months. This is something we have been using and incorporating. One day, hopefully I can get a in-house filtration system. We hadn't got there yet. <laughs> I do know, you know, like we were buying a lot of water and this cut down on water bottles. So, you know, if you do want to grab you one, I do like this one, like I said, because uh, the filter doesn't have to get changed to every so often, although I probably won't wait six months, but this can hold 10 cups of water. Now, tackling the garbage disposal can be sometimes a headache. I have found using these active garbage disposal cleaners to be super helpful and to cut down on how much grossness is in my garbage disposal. And you just pop these right into your garbage disposal, turn it on, follow the instructions, and they definitely keep those odors out. So if you have some odors and they're getting on your nerves with your garbage disposal, grab you some of these cleaners. They give you a year's supply for an awesome price point. And you can clean your garbage disposal out twice a month with these individually wrapped tablets. Pop them in there and let them go to work. You guys, I have been looking and searching for like one of the perfect products for cleaning my fruit and veggies and things like that. I am in love with this one because this is a like four in one. You can do so much with this. You do have an opening here and you have different attachment pieces, but you get a different attachment pieces. So you can do your cutting in this. If you're like shredding up veggies and things like that, you can do it right in this bowl. And you can also use this as a fruit and veggie cleaner because it has this bowl in here where you can do your washing in it, but then it tilts out. You see that? Such so water can drain right from the fruit without having to dip out the fruit and you can re-rinse it out, re drain it i love the drain functionality and if you ever want to take this out this pops right out so if you want to use this for mixing like cake mixes or baking or whatever you can use this as a mixing bowl too so it's just really awesome plus it has little spouts here for pouring it's just a great four in one to do a lot of your kitchen cleaning and prepping with this and i really like that it's dishwasher safe too <laughs> That's a bonus point. Now having mold and mildew and water draining from my dishes around the kitchen sink is such a big annoyance for me. One thing that I found to be very helpful is swapping out dish drying racks like that sit up on my countertop and then the water drain and mold build up in the bottom of it. Oh, that get on my nerves. A stone drying mat dries water instantly. And I started using a, a stone sink tray around my sinks for my dish soap and stuff like that. And I loved it. I loved them so much. I looked for a dish drying mat. And I came across this large one. It's really large, so it can fit your pots and your pans, lots of dishes. So if you are hand washing items, they can all dry right there. And I do not have to worry about mold and mildew and oh my God, like you do with your big dish drying racks that sit up on the counters. Plus, this doesn't sit up like a sore thumb and make your kitchen look cluttered. You can leave this sitting out on your countertops and your kitchen still looks really clean and chic and nice. So I do like that it lays flat, it blends in. It also has legs, so you can easily clean up under it when you need to, but airflow can get under there. Y'all, it's just been game changing having it in the kitchen. I definitely recommend them if you're looking for one or you're having that issue where the cleaning out those dish drying racks is getting on your nerves and the mold and mildew build up. Oof. Yes, try your stone dish drying rack. I walk around with water tumblers all day, every day, no matter where I'm going, running errands, around the house, going to games, it doesn't really matter. I have water with me. Now, an issue that I had is that a lot of times when it's knocked over, water will spill from it. But y'all, I came across this spill proof tumbler by Simple Modern. Look at this. No water. Spill proof. <laughs> Literally, I like this because I'm my kids that walk around, knock this off the table. I will, I'm clumsy to my dog, hit something. So having a spill proof tumbler has definitely been helpful because again, I don't have to worry about it leaking um, everywhere or even if it falls, you know. So this one's easy to use. You just push it down to lock it. And when you want to drink from it, you just, let me show you, you just pull this up 
and you can drink from it. So it's just a push and pull locking technique. So very simple to use. These are also dishwasher safe, which again, I like to make my life easier. We're busy, I'm a mom and working. I just don't have a lot of time to do a lot of hand washing. So I do like dishwasher safe items. I have washed this so many times. It still has held up, it still looks brand new. I have had no issue with it. Um, so this is something I do recommend too. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sure you enjoyed this next video as well.